messy, your market ready. Old school Chevy, outside jelly, inside peanut butter with the car selling. Car jelly, before it all get messy. Strawberry, haze, okay, I smoke heavy. Hands sweaty, but yet it's still my hands steady. I'm Sam Cook, the pillar with them brands look. I wrote the manual down, in the handbook. Shook ones, get thumbs down, we run down. Gun them down, tell me what you want now. David killed Goliath, I'm still on the label, so I'ma kill him till they quiet. Put your pockets on diet, boy, don't try it. Strip it to the block, on the same day I buy it. But you call hot wire. I knock his ass up lopsided. It's the psychotic, white chump, I pot it. Lock Ness, slingshot Ness. I got right now, I don't kill, got next. Report live from the project. Southwest Air Force Ones, we got checks, got checks. Don't even talk about the street, cause I got it. So acknowledge you got your head for our pocket. You tuned in to the Ball for Ball Radio Show. Battle Wars, you know what I'm saying? It's your boy Lou Phil, E Ness, Loch Ness Monster, E New Tron, Lou Gossett Jr., Lou Ferrigno, Lou Gang. Man, I got my special guest host in the building tonight. Man, this guy, like, I've been watching this guy, like, doing this thing for the past two, three, maybe, like, four years, really. Like, the nigga been um, uh, really, like, hooping, like, one of the up and coming scenes as far as battle rap is concerned for Philly, man. Introduce yourself, man. It's V's. V's the outlaw, man. Y'all already know what it is, man. South Philly, nigga, you know what I'm saying? V's. Morel, man. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to my man Ness, Lou Gang. You know what I'm saying? We ain't shout out Glockaway Radio. Shout out to the whole Philly, man. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to all the battle rappers holding it down in Philly, too, even though we don't get that recognition. You know what I'm saying? But it's all year. Bottom line, we about to make sure that shit come back home. Definitely. Shout out to my brother, uh, Kaboom, in the motherfucking building. Boom! Body bag, boom, cast, gang, represent, man. You already know. You know what I mean? That, 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 that's also another fellow Philly battle rapper that's on the card, March 10th, the Ground Zero. Shouts out to uh, Kapal Nov and um, Yak Man for coming up last weekend, really showing love, man, letting everybody know what's going on and just the ins and outs of the, uh, the the battle rap industry and culture as far as the business concerned. All the mishaps and false starts that come with that shit. With these, why did you get started and actually, well, I know you didn't, did you really like come off the step as a battle rapper or you was just an artist period? And no, I, I came off just rapping, bro, you know what I'm saying? Before I even met you, you know what I'm saying? I'm saying? I used to look up to you and shit, you know what I'm saying? Respect. You were one of the niggas I looked up to you know, before I even met you and shit. I ain't come up no battle rapper, you know what I'm saying? I just had bars, you know what I'm saying? I could always correct and shit, you know what I'm saying? So this battle shit was easy and shit, so it was easy for me to step in that lane. Rest in peace to home, DJ Big Philly. You know what I'm saying? He gave my opportunity. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, like, he gave like, a lot of niggas opportunity in the city to start off with that shit. You know what I'm saying? As far as like battle rap concerns in Philadelphia, Big Philly, like really like when it really wasn't no market for it, Big Philly was really like was the one that was throwing events and giving away nigga cars and type of shit like that. So rest in peace to Big Philly, man. He did a lot of shit for Philly battle rap culture, man. And um, just like how you your brotherhood and how you like loaded up your, your, your truck and you had Black Money Mugga and, you know what I'm saying, yeah. Stampede, like, and said, these, you come from that era with, like, well, I, coming out of your era, I would say, um, what do you feel is your rank coming out of the area? My rank. Era. For those not to know, I mean, let everybody know your affiliation with, you know, Butter from the Block. You know yeah, that's all, that's all there is AOG shit, always on go, green light gang, you know what I'm saying? My man Lyle Mack, you know what I'm saying? The whole gang, you know what I'm saying? I ain't got name more. They know who they is already and shit. But you know what I'm saying? This shit, my rank right now, my rank right now in Philly is like, I'm him right now. You know what I'm saying? Basically. I'm him. You know what I'm saying? If I ain't him, I'm the, so, I'm the next him. Bottom line. So, like, who's, like, just, just to name a few artists, like, as far as battle rap is concerned, we just talk strictly battle rap now. Yeah. Who, like, coming out of your graduating class, like, who are the elite? Battle rappers of your graduating class coming out of Philadelphia. Well, see the niggas that came out when I was in street arena and shit. They all ain't really like you know what I'm saying all up there right now. But it's a it was like the class right after street arena and shit. You know what I'm saying? So we got like the big hands. With Dub was in the street arena era and shit. Someone was like Dub the Phenom. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Big hand. Dub the Phenom. You know what I'm saying? Um, Bliss Creed trying to get back in the mix. Shout out to my man Bliss. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to Bliss Creed. You know what I'm saying? Um, who else? My 
Butter wasn't really in the, in the home street arena era, but Butter like really one of the talented niggas in, that's doing this shit right now in the city with this shit. You know what I'm saying? It's a few other niggas like my nigga G's LaFlair. You know what I'm saying? He just battled Rosenberg Raw in the last powerhouse joint and shit. Had a classic joint with Rosenberg. You know what I'm saying? He one of the young niggas and one of the new faces of Philly. Whereas though, it's I ain't gonna name myself, I name him. Uh, right, right, you know what right. You I'm saying? Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, like if you wouldn't name yourself, you'd probably name me or somebody else. You know what I'm saying? Right, that's right. why I named my man G's LaFlair and shit. You know what I'm saying? Well, I've been on, I've went on record. As far as social media is concerned to endorse you, I think that you have a really bright future. Not like talking about it's like you haven't, you already started already. So you definitely get the recognition. So tell everybody what's going down March 10th, who your opponent is. March 24th, bro, we lit. Bro, it's March 24th. It's March 24th, bro. I'm it's sorry. It's March 24th, oh, Battle Academy. Yeah, you Battle know Academy. Know what I'm it was supposed to be V's versus New Jersey Twerk. He got a battle this month on URL and shit, so it ain't going down, you know what I'm saying? So right now it's, it's V's versus Stax Calhoun and shit. My man Stead set that up, you know what I'm saying? Battle Academy shit, you know what I'm saying? My mistake for all the, for all the fans out there, all the people on IG watching this, that was my bad. It's March 24th, the Battle Academy, Rick Dang. Hip hop since 1987. Shouts out to Rick Dang. Shouts out to Stiz. Right so on. this is this is it, right? I mean, March 24th, bro. March 24th. March 24th. Well, I ain't studio. battled this year yet, either, bro. And like the, the, a lot of the battle rap world know me and shit. The whole okay, thing. so I'm glad you said that. How does it feel to be out of the ring, to be inactive so long, and to come back and been? I, are you are you? Gonna be able to shake the rust off because it doesn't like people. See, people think, oh, you don't have to battle all year, and then you just hop in the battle, and then you be hot, and then whatever. It's only special cases like that. But for you not to be active, and t tell the fans and the people and the people that's watching this, the preparation and. The, the mental and the physicality that goes behind preparing for one of these battles. I'm gonna keep it a band. If a nigga on um, like like fall, say like I call it, I call it, I'm, I've been falling back. You know what I'm saying? If a nigga falling back for so long, whereas though it's like he ain't even really into all that battle rap shit right okay. now. You know what I'm saying? He into real life shit that's going on right now. So it'd be like a little juggle up whereas then I want to step back in, but I got real life shit going on too right now. Whereas though for me, this battle rap shit ain't never fall off. It's just like I had a whole lot of real shit going on. Whereas though, all right, that ain't my main focus. You see what I'm saying? So basically, what, real life kept you. Yeah, it was the real from it was like real life in the battle yeah. rap. But yeah. I'm saying that you definitely did a, um, a hell of a job for yourself, man. And I, you know what I'm saying, I definitely know you're gonna bring home the W. Come on March 24th. So everybody that's the, the, don't know about this this event, this event is is just like epic, man. It's like me and the DNA rematch. Shh. is on the card. Boom is on DNA, the card. Man, bottom you know line. Bill Collector's on the card. So this card, like, I mean, for the past couple shows, I've been having people that's attached to the events that's coming up. That's just logic, people, okay? So we just promoting what we got in front of us. We only can see what we got in front of us. So... Definitely V's, we gonna chill, we gonna sit, we gonna smoke, we gonna listen to the music. Bro, you and, you, you and Boom really one of the niggas that reasons I started battling. Man, that's why I got Boom up here, because you Boom, Boom has really, been very vocal on Boom, 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 Boom beat Tay Rock, bro. He's been I'm gonna very, tell you that. No, listen, that's go what I'm ahead, saying. Go ahead, that's you can talk, why, bro, go ahead. Bro. Hold up, that's what I'm saying. He's not one of these guys that fly, like, he has in history through the whole shit. Even to win, you know what I'm saying? So wrong with him. let these niggas know. I want I want everybody to know the the the, the, the Philly battle rap culture and how long it stretches and goes back well, to where the, niggas is looking at these top ten dudes that's on Smack or URL. And we already been, in, you know, what I'm saying, and got in the ring and tore them up. So you know, what I mean, we gonna get into some music, man. It's the Ball for Ball Radio Show. Shouts out to my boy. Oh, and Easy in the motherfucking building. Shouts out to my nigga Two Can in the motherfucking building. V's my co-host, V's the fucking what? Outlaw, nigga, bottom line, South Philly around. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to West Philly, you know what I'm saying? Shout out to them touch money niggas, free bricks, bottom line. Right, yeah. Yeah. Fucking no, man, we coming right We're back, wrong. man, after this motherfucking segment with your boy, Body Bag Boom, the Ball for Ball Radio Show, Glock away. Yeah. I know, I was supposed to battle Prince Mafia. V's, 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 and Boom Nail, some heavy battle rap talk. Back to the Ball for Ball Radio uh, Show. Move that cup, yo. We just, we just, we just need a cup. Oh, shit. Man, Bob got everything. Yeah. So, V's, what you, um, as far as the state of battle rap, man, what you, like, how far has it come, man? What you think about it being worldly and how it is today as far as being overseas and the, uh, 
the don't flops and the oxymoron with the Russian shit and all that. How you feel about that? I feel like all that shit, like, that shit like motivation, bro. Like, I like it. Mm -hmm. I like that shit. Real rap. Mm -hmm. That shit motivation, the oxymoron. Come. I didn't know, you didn't know that nigga either, bro. Like, I ain't <laughs> know that no, motherfucker, bro. No, he come over here and get a billion views, whatever yeah. how many views he got, bro. He get all the views. It's all because the country support us, like 12 million. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. That's, yeah, like, that's, that's what I'm saying. It's like, damn. If I, if I had that support, the whole Philly behind me, Population but, look, really crazy. but look, the thing about Oxymoron is he was like a recording artist that's popular in Russia. Right. Oh, see, yeah, I don't even know his whole, history. You got, a whole, you got the whole country of Russia. That yeah, just, he already got the whole so right. yeah. 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 Combine that with King I like Africa. that type so, shit, bro. Hold up, so just to cut and dry, I just gotta get straight to it because y'all two like infamous battle rappers are like two of the best battle rappers coming out of Philly. That's right. In my book. That's right. Well, top five on y'all. Hit list. Who would y'all next five if y'all had to pick and you could do the Floyd Mayweather Golden Boy promotions and I can fight whoever I want to fight. I can get in the ring whoever I want to get. Who what would your next five battles be? I'm gonna start with I'ma start with you, Bone. Alright, right, you know I'm real strategic with it, you know what I'm saying? So I would say my next battle. Oh my fault. I'm real strategic with it, so I say I would want my next battle to be Rod. I would want to Rod. That's like a once yeah. out of that. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Stead, set it up, Stead. I like that. Set it up, Stead. I actually like the whole one to go in I'm kind of surprised you would say Rod. Ooh, but you know what? what? I see that. your angle. But could you tell the people why? Because. He's going to give me a battle, like he's right. going, he's going to display his oh, no, that's punches. Facts. That's facts. And yeah. that's going to give me an opportunity to, to, to really display my punches. So that's you know definitely saying? going to be... Because I'm going to automatically be the underdog. They're going to automatically think, oh, because he was active and I'm, and, and I'm in a sense coming back that I'm not going to be somehow <laughs> not knowing that I've been battling for the past three years going to my skills. So they're gonna sleep on me. So it's gonna be a bar fest, I feel like. Mm -hmm. Alright, Ryder, Boom. that's one. So it's Ryder. Boom. Then after my next a, 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 after Ryder, I will want John John. I will want John John to dine. Shout out to the bullpen battle league. Shout out to John John bullpen. Because he's like I said, he's hot. And he's a tall guy, so he'd be way tall. <laughs> so that would give me a whole angle. He's like, 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 like big like, like opponents, you know? huh? Yeah, bro, I love God. big opponents. That's my, that's where I shine. All right, you gotta keep it coming, boy, because yeah. I gotta, you know, right, I gotta right, ask you. Right, right, you know, I gotta right, ask right, you a right, question that everybody fast. want me to ask yeah, you. Go ahead. <laughs> All right, so where I was at, number two. Number yeah. two. Yeah, tell me two was. Uh, right. No, no you said Ryder, then you said. John, John, John. I said John, John, the Don. Then I would want um, Big K. I would want Big K next. Yes, Big K. I would want Big K. Then I would want Rum Nitty. I would want Rum Nitty. Then I want Overhead. Okay. No, I'm, I'm about to ask you about Overhead. V's, what's your, what's your five? We're going to come right back to you. Boom. What's your five? My top five? No, like not top five. Who would the no, next? No, I know okay. the battle that I'm about to battle. I would want to battle. A band is though one about to happen. On the next battle academy, the twerk, New no. Jersey twerk. I gave no. JC the first round, no. I believe. No. But yeah, my own. That's so two. You said twerk. You said JC. JC third. I would want to battle on Briz. Briz tough. Okay. I would want to battle with Briz. Just dropped the calico. Well, that's probably been out for. A yeah, that's months cool. No, that's cute. No, man. <laughs> so shout man. out to Briz, yeah, man. Dark Side. Man. What's that? Three. That's number four. Three. You know what I'm saying? I mean, I stop, I stop, I stop loving this shit for real, cause you know what I'm saying. I got on some politics shit. I give me two more. I though. give you two more. I go motherfucking like. I want battle rock, cause I think that shit just pre hype on URL and rock my man on the killer. Yeah, on URL and shit. You know what I'm saying? And, and, and only his second you round. And only his seven, second round. Still did good against Arsenal and Sharon. Yeah, his second oh, round. That's what I'm talking about. Well, he's the second round. He's solidified. Second round. That's what I'm saying. Second, like second round kick. He's the second round kick. Rock, rock is like you know what I'm saying. So you got rock. No, not if you come here. One more. 
And this this would be for the city and shit. Like, you know what I'm saying? Just cause like he like the GOAT in the city, like not not like the GOAT, but like my era type battle rap nigga for the city. It, I, I wanna battle Reed, like at the end of the day. I that's why I wanna battle Reed. See, I thought we was like, 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 like pulling teeth. It's like pulling teeth, but I'm, we will get into that niggas from the city battling city. But before I go, I got we gotta ask you about the Cicero. We gotta ask you about the Cicero battle <laughs> one, with okay, the outcome of that. Let's talk. And okay, we all know the summer night that went down. It was uh, the Battle Academy. They put on another uh, good battle. You was on a car. You battled Cicero. Cicero is also from Philadelphia. Cicero has an illustrious battle career. He had known battles. Mm -hmm. Public battles with Meek Mills, public battles with the Young Guns, so he's mm -hmm. battle tested. Game, mm -hmm. This battle, the previous battle before we seen Cicero, we seen Cicero on Crack Liberty Battle League, and he had a uh, one-off with Twice. Bishop Brigante, and he totally forgot his material, which was a bad look. The second time, he battled you. Yeah. So coming off that and the flag that he got from that, so just get the people like the setup to the battle and what was the outcome and all the commotion that went on. First of all, we was like, yo, sis hot. I wanna battle sis. You know what I'm saying? He the only other like active battle rapper with a name that I know we can have a classic on. Okay. You know what I mean? Because it's just certain people that I don't wanna battle. I, I will battle them if the money's right for people like you. The money's right on a big platform with both could, could benefit, yeah. But it, it's, it's certain, the way I go into battle is certain people that I don't want to battle. Okay. You know what I mean? It's just it's certain things that I don't want to, I don't like, because it's a different type of respect I think about real life. No, I'm so sorry. Anyway, we so, came in the battle, because he, he came out, who went first? So was listen, it you and him? Him. So he came out, actually. No, no, I went first. Yeah, you did, you went first. I went first, you feel what I'm saying? You know, we had it set that we was going to battle and and being as though that I really, really know him on some other crazy wild shit, he was like, yo, I don't want you to say nothing. <laughs> blah, 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 blah. So I didn't, you know what I'm saying? So we get up there and battle just because, come on, man, like Philly is a small city. Just because I know your mom name, I know your sister's name. That's not my fault your yeah, baby mom's family called me. That the brother, the brother, the people of the brother that she used to bang with that died called me. So that your best friends, that this, that, and the third. You know what I'm saying? So basically Crazy. it was personal. It was like... I already didn't like yeah, it, it was because like, he it choked was the bitch and forgot okay. they better. All right. That's that's that was just ice on the cake besides the fact I really know him in real life. So it was like I had to deal with that. I had to deal with, with all that, you know what I'm saying? When I'm seeing him and I'm blah, 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 blah. And, you know what I mean, I'm just like, just go ahead, bro. You judge. You got so, what you need. So then, then, so then, then like, through the battle, it was a good battle. So explain the third round where, you know, no, that's what I'm saying. You had to go last. No, I went because first. Because you had to. No, I because just went again. He choked and you had the last Because I just went again. again. He went again. He went again. I rapped three battle. times. He rapped oh, twice. Oh, okay. So that was with the... So yeah, explain yeah, to the people. Think about that. <laughs> after the three rounds regulation, after he choked, you yeah. just went again randomly. I just randomly. went again. I said, fuck it. And it didn't sit right with him. So what, what was that whole issue about? First of all, I mean, he tried to get all rowdy to be, to be seen that it was too many people there. That wasn't happy about that. <laughs> right. And he, we went to the back and talked. And he just he was telling me that I'm gonna keep it on He said his sister got mental problems and if she had a name, she gonna go crazy. This is what he told me. I said, bro, come on, man. People say shit about shit all the time, bro. People say shit about like people, daughters and grandmas. There's no ill intent, bro. This is the battle, bro. That's what we do. We supposed to get out there, rip each other to shreds, and then link up, bro. Show niggas that we crazy and imagine us together. That's what we supposed to do. You supposed to come in my neck, bro. Thanks. Like we supposed to tear each other down in there, bro. Thanks. What are you talking about, bro? You feel what I'm saying? So, I ain't I ain't say nothing about the shit that me and you went through. I ain't necessarily say nothing personal. I'm talking personal. Well, I can say, yo, you did this when this happened. Right. Yes or no? Well, guess what? I brought the ball with me. Uh, 
niggas went and had shit to say that. Yo, like I could have had said all kinds of stuff. <laughs> so, you know? On the positive vibe, we see you got the casket game, she got the clothing line. Yeah, I'm just merchandising my slogan. You know what I'm saying? You know, I tell about niggas. About branding. Let, let, let these up and coming battle rappers know about branding and how important the importance of branding and merchandising Listen, and shit like that. The whole point is to slap an image. Is the burnt is the imprint of image. Yeah you know I'm saying now listen, people in this room seen that my joint was caskets. They might not think nothing of it. They might look at it and say, Oh, that's hot. They somebody look at it and say, It's alright, and somebody say it's not. But they seen it. Boom. So now let's take it's a young lady to the side. Let's say she's walking downtown one day and she sees somebody with a casket shirt on. She like that look. She's not gonna pay no mind really, but she's just like, damn. I seen that shirt. I seen that the words before somewhere. Right. Oh, day nothing. Oh, she go to this club. See, she this girl with this nice casket. You know what I'm saying? Like, like, like top on, like nice tank top thing on. Oh, she got this Whoa, nice halter top. You know what I'm saying? She got this nice casket gang pup. like crazy sweater. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? With the caskets and the sweater oh my all God. night. She might be like, dang, that's on hot. Boom, you just created a brand. You know what I'm saying? This is what I say at the end of all my performances because I don't even call them battles no more because they're performances. Mm -hmm. You know Fact. That's what it is. That's so, what they get caught up in. So, so they forget to entertain, bro. So we throw it out there. At the end of my performance, I try to tell them since I'm in a battle rap trying to kill my opponent, this is just another funeral ride. These niggas dead. I'm going to order you an Uber to God. Caskets. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> And, and, and so, you know, I like that. And you can take that as any meaning, like you're killing the game, you know what I'm saying? You doing good, you about to take an Uber to God, you know what I'm saying? You want you met you might make a nigga take an Uber to God. You so high. Man, I'm so high, I'm about to take this Uber to God. Man. Like you could take it any kind of way, you know what I'm saying? And it's gonna be like real apparel, like the merchandise is gonna be like Real, real apparel. It's not gonna be just like no winky dinky shirts and no winky dinky hoodies. No, that little, that little windbreaker you know on that thing. We we gonna have like windbreakers, <laughs> track jackets, denim jean jackets, all ripped up crazy with the with the logo patches and the jeans and shit. So yeah, I you asked you like, like before, between segments, did you have a spot or a specific website where people can go? And actually purchase the merchandise you said that's I mean, under construction right yeah, now. Yeah, yeah, the website under construction, but for right now you just go to my Instagram at Body Bag Boom and I got up a few pieces and you can pick what you want and DM me your size and pricing. You know what I'm saying? DM me your size and pricing. And you know what I mean I send it right out to you. And and and, and you can put in orders too. Like you can say, yo I want a um, I want a brown windbreaker with orange, with orange oh, yeah, the guys in the corner. So you yeah, like, so so you, like you, you like you like body bag Amazon, huh? Yeah. 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 If you want to rock, this going on. Yeah. Yeah. If you want to rock my logo, I want you to rock it with how you uh, rock your shit. So so yeah, you know I'm saying outside the music and the clothing, I mean, outside the battles, yeah. upcoming battles and the clothing line. You got any music you're working on? Any up and coming projects you're working on? Yeah, I got a few projects I'm working on. Talk about I'm it. Just, um, I got one project called Audio Dope. You know what I'm saying? Because the audio is going to be dope. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I got so, a so um, explanatory. You know, mm -hmm. I'm working on the uh, Caskets, Volume 1, Uber the God, Volume 1. You know what I'm saying? Those are going to be like dedication type. Jones, where I just jack everybody beat and just go for like three minutes. He's giving this material you out free. Or I'm not. I'm, I'm gonna be giving it out free, of course, because you know what I'm saying. Okay. Like, I know the market, but I'm not mad if people want to support. You know what I mean? If it want to be a situation no like, yeah, man, project, niggas got more motherfucking Instagram followers than they got money. So if, 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 if all these Instagram followers, they want to support <laughs> artists, is, man, start giving up a dial up for them downloads and that's what them, I be saying. And giving them clicks yeah, you know, for the fucking sound. I'll, can I ask y'all questions? Since I grew up knowing, like I'm saying, looking like I'm saying, liking both of y'all, like y'all was my like 
top five niggas. Go ahead, bro. How would y'all feel about if a nigga set up a DVD again, like a DVD, like not the whole era, but just like a DVD for the, for the whole street? I think it, it will pop. pop for the street. I think it will you know pop. You know what I be telling niggas? Like I, I, my whole thing would, my whole thing be like the only issue with niggas would be Hollywood and be trying to ask for too much. No, see the whole thing with the DVD. Everybody, everybody think they a star now. So just niggas coming off the block, they think they, you know what I'm saying? The, the, the mentality is different right now. But before we get out of here, man, I mean, I know you got shout outs, man. Let everybody know where they can find you at social media. It's basically at Body Bag Boom. Like you know what I'm saying? For everything, Twitter, for everything, Instagram, for everything, at Body Facebook, Bag Boom, everything. Any yeah. shout outs? Any shout outs? Yeah, any last? Man. Uh. Yeah, you know I mean, rest in, rest in paradise, my little brother B. You know what I'm saying? Free my bro Kill King. You know what I mean? Free Brick of Raw. Free um, Snow Woods. Absolutely. You know what I mean? Free and, guys. V, you got anybody you want to show up to? everybody that's booked. You already know, man. I just want to shout out the whole, the whole South Philly bottom line. Rest in peace, my little nigga Nas, my little nigga Tuli. Rest in peace, my little nigga Note. You know what I'm saying? Barge and Village shit. You know what I'm saying? Right. That's about it, bro. You know what I'm saying? Let everybody Facebook know where they can find you at on the V I Z Z24 on the gram. The bottom line, just follow me. Yeah, so these both of these brothers is as long with myself will be gonna be on this card March 24th, man, the Battle Academy, man. So y'all like it, man. Philly coming to represent y'all already fucking No, it's Lou Phil to Trill, Glasgow Radio. Each and ball for time. ball, battle wars, body bag, boom, these the outlaw back away. Yeah, 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 yeah. Ball for ball, battle wars. Slingshot messy, your market ready. Old school Chevy, outside jelly, inside peanut butter with the car selling, car jelly, before it all get messy, strawberry, haze, okay I smoke heavy, hand sweaty, but yet and still my hand steady, I'm Sam Cook, the pillar with them grams look, I wrote the manual down, in the handbook, shook ones, get thumbs down, we run down, gun them down, tell me what you want now, David killed Goliath, I'm still on the label, so I'ma kill him till they quiet, put your pockets on diet, boy don't try it, strip it to the block on the same day I buy it, but you call hot wire. Hot wire. I knock this thing up lopsided. It's the psychotic. Wide jump, I pot it. Ah, lock ness, slingshot ness. I got right now, I don't kill, got next. Report live from the project. Southwest Air Force Ones, we got checks, got checks. Don't even talk about the street, cause I got it. So acknowledge, you nod your head for our pocket.